Hi, I'm Marshall Fike. Uh, I'm the team leader for our team in Omaha this year. Uh, I'm originally from Westmoreland, Kansas and graduated from Kansas State University in 2022. I first encountered the Culture Project at K-State. They came to give a talk to our Catholic Student Center. I actually didn't even get to attend the talk, but uh, I heard about them from some of their missionaries hanging out in the lobby. And it really caught my eye that uh, people were talking about the issues with pornography, the issues with the culture, and how just invested we are with uh, our selfish desires sometimes. And, actually recognizing that the desires that God has given us for our sexuality, for people of the opposite sex, even for relationships in general, was actually an inherently good thing, and then it was supposed to lead us to love other people around us more intensely. Uh, my call to the Culture Project specifically uh, really manifested itself in my experience with dating in high school and college. I really just found myself putting a lot of my self-worth in whether I was dating or not. And so when I didn't date through all of high school and through most of college, I really found that I had a dejected kind of self-view that because nobody was interested in me or because I wasn't dating, that I was somehow worth less. But I found that through theology of the body and through diving more into my faith, that that is the opposite of true. It doesn't matter if I'm in a relationship or who I'm dating even, but that I'm loved exactly where I am. Um, and obviously these problems tend to manifest, uh, especially for guys in a problem with pornography addiction, which was something that uh, I experienced in high school as well. Um, and so one of the real joys of this year was uh, we went and gave a sexual integrity talk to guys at this high school this year. I was in Philadelphia last year. And uh, after we gave those talks, one of the chaplains of the school came up to us and he told us that since we had come, the confessions of the students had increased in quality and in number. That these students were actually coming to the chaplain with their sins, with their sexual sins, uh, and really wanting to be reconciled with the Lord and live out this love that we're proclaiming at the Culture Project. Uh, and that was just a really special moment for this year.